Alrighty, well, hello everyone, Rissy Toothpick here. Uh, first time streaming, so we're going to check it out. But what we're planning on doing today is just pretty much go around clearing out all the areas that we might have missed, like the Mongol territory. Um, and really what we're trying to do is get all the collectibles or trophies, pretty much. So let's just keep on going here. First things off, we're down here in the south. We're going to go clear out Tangled Crossroads, apparently, because that's the mission. We're going to go to the Bamboo Strike just to check it out. I and mean, hopefully we don't get killed. Game super loud. Turn that down. Alrighty. Call the horse. That's right. You get over here. Alright, so we need to go this way, apparently. Maybe. Really stuck in the corner here. I <laughs> get them flowers though. But yeah, if uh, anything goes wrong here, let me know. Like I said, first time streaming, so. There's no telling what issues yeah. might appear. <laughs> but yeah, if we haven't seen the videos, we got like 60 of them or something like that, where I've pretty much completed the game. All the main missions have been taken care of. No issues whatsoever. Anyways, not enough of that. We're also rolling with our antlered helmet, the ghost's mask, and the traveler's attire because we want to get all the relics. And there's apparently Mongols here. But we're just gonna let them be. I'm gonna say I don't have a... No fight to give. Let's see, let's make sure we're still going the right way. Oh, they're pissed off though. <laughs> they're still shooting arrows at me. Oh, got stuck in a little branch. Man, they're still attacking. I'll say we already went across the whole damn hill. All right, I think this is it right here. I have a pretty good feeling. Oh, we can stand off. Is that a good idea? You know what? Let's put on our sake clan armor. Send your best warrior. Now let's see if we can get them all. And we were right at our location. Let's see if we can kill them all. Yeah, he's got that faint. All right, there's one, two, three. Four, and then five. Alrighty. Did we get an achievement for that? All in the wrist. Yes, we did. Oh, there's the first one. Ugh. And then apparently the spearman showed up, or their leader. You can tell by his armor. And he's dead. Let me lower that a little bit more. Ooh. Didn't hear you there. Avoid some serpentine action. Ooh, just a one shot kill, huh? Alrighty, we got eight iron for it, which is kind of pointless because we fully upgraded our blade. Let's go back to our traveler's attire and let's pick up that Mongol artifact. We're working for that as well. Mongolian horses are often armored as much as the Mongol warriors themselves. Their preferred breed are relatively small but very hardy, capable of surviving extreme conditions. Almost every Mongolian warrior has more than one horse, so they can swap fresh mounts as the horses tire. Well, they got no loyalty to one horse. They're just like, give me the best horse, and when it dies, it's just like, keep on going. But nah, usually they do have a horse that they like. Alright, let's keep on looking. There might be some more things here. Bit of supplies. Uh, ammo. Nothing too crazy there. Fortunately, I don't really feel any more artifacts, so I think we're good to go. We're just going to pull up all these supplies. Let's look here. Alrighty, and I'm a little suspicious about these undiscovered locations. I kind of want to check them out since we are here. We'll call our horse. 
Alrighty. And now I'm trying to figure out what is the fastest way <laughs> to get where we're going. Hopefully we don't kill our horse here. Alright, let me look here. So we pretty much need to take the beach. A little weird, but I think we should. Might be a little risky. We're going to take the mountain up above. See where that takes us. And there's people here, apparently. Well, hello there. But that is not where... Oh, you know what? I bet you it's that right there. I say would not surprise me. Kind of looks important. All right, pillar of honor. We got Twilight Oni as Nightfall's death approaches. And that looks pretty fancy. Looks like I took drugs <laughs> and I was like having weird visions. With that one taken care of, though, we're going to move here. And we'll see. We went from healthy to a poor stream, huh? And that sucks. Now, why is that? YouTube is not receiving enough video. I'm going to have to look into that, ain't I? I'll just watch it. I'll watch it when we get done. See what it's looking like. Let me go this way. Yeah, we're pretty close either way. 150 meters. Oh, of course, there's a bear. I always run into bears. I don't want nothing to do with you, bear. Leave me alone. Alright. A little bit to our left. Alright, survivor camp. Also a place where we can trade and whatnot. We'll also look for any artifacts while we're here. Fortunately, it doesn't seem like that this is an issue here. And we don't need any upgrades as well. We're good. Alright, so with that taken care of... I mean, we might as well just go for the salt wind estate. Already, yeah, it's like really close to here, so nowhere we could probably walk there to be honest. But I'll say it's just right down the road. It's weird because that's actually a Mongol camp, so literally, right down the road is a whole nother Mongol camp. Do we want to do another standoff? I mean, we might as well. I mean, it's easy. Let's put back our armor. Come and fight! Like we're gonna kill like half of them right here. The only problem is if people get in the way. Someone oh, I hate spearmen. Let's see, ooh, he went for that attack. Yep, got another one. Sometimes it's hard because you're used to them, you know, doing those feints, and then they don't. Spearmen always have problems with spearmen, but we got him taken care of as well. That guy's scared over there. Let's put him down before he gets back up. Never mind, he's running. <laughs> I guess you can't run, huh? You gonna shoot your arrow at me? Ooh, I got lucky. Longbow. Uh-oh. I feel sorry for you because this is probably an explosive arrow. <laughs> yeah, he did. Alright, where's the other guys here? We'll put him down. Oh. Come on now. Okay, he's done. One shot him. Oh, let me avoid that. Oh, he's a little quick. Ah, didn't see him there. Come on now. Oh, see, I've been waiting for you to do a regular attack. Oh, I see you. I'm coming. Don't worry. Let's break that shield. Oh, never mind. We're on the blade. But we killed him anyways. I guess it didn't matter. Okay, there's two there. They... Oh. Where were you hiding? 
Don't worry, I'm coming for you. Don't, don't think you can run away. Alrighty, he's dead. Uh, two of them over here. Oh, that's kind of dirty of y'all. Oh, wow. Like, you're so overpowered when you go back. I like see everything all over again. <laughs> like, no problems whatsoever. One shot on them with the, uh, was that, the Dance of Wrath? If I remember correctly. I mean, you can't go wrong with that. And our Mongo Artifact. So what do we have here? The Yatka? The, Trish the Yatka is a traditional Mongolian plucked zither. It's a closely related to the Chinese... Guzing? <laughs> Don't mind my uh, Chinese and Mongolian. The strings are commonly made for, from horsehair or goose gut, though the number of strings can vary. Ooh, I see. Interesting. And of course, we got more iron. So I guess if you're trying to upgrade your katana and you get kind of like afraid when you see that hundred iron needed for your blade, just clear out some places and then you'll be good to go. I mean, that's what I'm noticing. Like, every time we clear a place out, it's like 10, 20 iron, so. Can't complain with that. Let's clear it out. Let's also put back on our traveler's attire, just to make sure there's nothing we're missing here. Must say, he'll let me know. We'll just run around in a big old circle. Because that's what we do. Everything's looking good, though. All right, so with that taken care of, I think we need to check out these three locations. First thing, we're going to look for that one. Let us fast travel. Make it a bit quicker. And I guess we just follow the trail. Call the horse. Get your ass over here. We ride to dawn. But alright, and I guess it's probably going to be somewhere in this wood that's been cut. Uh, there's a bear, of course. Always a bear. Ooh, a fox den. Yes. Yeah, oh, nope. Never mind. They're hogs. You can tell when you see, notice more than one. Alright. Well, I'm assuming the altar might be in this building here. Makes sense. Oh, nope. Never mind. But we're definitely going to check that out. Might be something of value. Maybe a banner. You never know with them banners. Oh, nope. I see it. We'll definitely have to pet the fox if he's around <laughs> when we get this. We shall see, though. Alrighty. Don't mind me. You should be happy. With that taken care of, I definitely want to check out that building. We're going to want to look for that one. There's a bamboo strike that we need to do. So we will be busy. So we'll just jump up here. Looks like they're fine. You are the ghost. If it's true, thank you. Yeah, so they're just going to tell us, hey, you're the ghost. We appreciate everything you do for us, poisoning the enemy and then letting them learn how to poison. All right, but with that taken care of, we got to run all the way over here. Fastest way. <laughs> Some more fast traveling. Oh, we're on this mountain. Now, I've died here before. But we're gonna be, we're gonna try to be risky here. <laughs> it's in the name of the game. Don't mind me. Somehow we're not dead yet. I'm really surprised, actually. Oof. Yeah, that's actually one of the rarest times where I've actually succeeded in getting down the mountain. And we're actually going the right way. I say, like, time to keep on moving. Alright, we're gonna get some bamboo here. Going the right way. Yeah, of course there's Mongols. Face me! Yeah, let's do another standoff. Oh no, not Mongols, bandits. Ooh. 
Let's see if he does a faint. Oh, he didn't, but I thought he did. <laughs> Zero Man completely missed us. They shouldn't do a lot of damage, though. I mean, they're rolling around with, like, very weak weaponry. Nope, you're dead. Missed you that first time, but you're definitely dead. Ooh, we got technique point. Oh, too quick. Let's give it a moment. Oh. Let's see, give it one more moment. All right, let's see here. Techniques. Ooh, we actually got the last one. Okay, so everything's been leveled up now, so we're good to go. Yeah, no worries whatsoever there. So now when we get technique points, we just won't use them. Unless, unless there's something I don't know about. Uh, hogs, they might come at us. Y'all better stay away. I'll put you down with an arrow. You be careful with them hogs. Sometimes they're aggressive, sometimes they're not. They're like, hmm. When he's not looking, we all rush and attack him. <laughs> Alright, looks like this might be a shrine. Let's see here. Yep. That's what I'm assuming it is. Gotta go around that big old circle. Ooh, actually, that kind of worries me just a bit. It looks like the only way to get up there is through here. Oh, but there's a bird, isn't there? I want to say, I heard you, golden bird. I know you're nearby. Ooh, there's something, maybe something up here? We can check out a good, like, overlook of the area from up here. It's a whole bench. Don't you dare fall down. Okay, well, that was enough uh, looking around. It's time to keep on moving here. Yep, we gotta swing through some trees here. Yeah. Hopefully we don't die, but knowing me, there's no telling. All right, Arrow Peak Shrine. I'm assuming we're gonna get a talisman or something like that charm that will benefit our bow. If it's, you know, the name of the game. Uh, where are we though? Oh, a whole scroll. We ran when the Mongols came. Father said that Kami will keep us safe. The shrine would be a good hiding spot, offer us protection. Alrighty, so the shrine is up there. It kind of tries to trick you by going the other way. And gaming with mercy. Ah, there's, uh, I believe two others. Or, well, if you're involved, then there's one other person watching. Okay, so these Tori gates lead to Arrow Peak Shrine, Sanctuary of Inari, Kami of Agriculture. I think the way over is right over here. Let's see if we can make it work. Okay, let me look up. Nope, we just need to jump. The only good thing about the shrines, though, is there's always flowers to be found. So convenient. Oh, but yeah, y'all watching, if there's any issues, let me know. I had an issue when we, like, drive, or drive, when we ride the horse that have some issues, because I guess there's not enough of the game being done, I'm not for sure. But when we're, like, fighting or whatnot, it's got excellent condition, or connection, so. No telling. Oh, hold up, almost died. <laughs> Almost ran right into that mountain. Let's see some bamboo. Uh, let's see here. How do we get through? Linen, another scroll. Father's sick. We can't stop shivering, and we're running out of food. As if that weren't bad enough, the Mongols are back. Brother is scared. They'll find a way across the bridge. Ooh, I see. All right, now, where do we go? This is kind of weird. It's taking us like a roundabout. Uh, 
Oh man, I got scared of that bird. <laughs> it was like running through. Alrighty, now from here, I guess we drop down. Jump over here. And I think we've reached the top. What is that? Oh, oh, another scroll. Father died last night. I'm so tired, but I can't sleep. Not while the sun is out. It's beautiful up here. Oh, are you dead somewhere? Everyone look for a dead body. Usually there's one. We're gonna get the bamboo though, and the flowers. I don't see a dead body, so maybe the person that wrote the scrolls survived? Or they're down there where that blood's at dead. One or the other. But anyways, let's us honor the shrine. We got the charm of Inari, charm of the Kami of Agriculture. Now, what does that do? Increase supplies, predator hides, bamboo, and you would gain from collecting. Oh, now I wish I got this a long time ago. <laughs> that would have been a lot. Like that'd be very beneficial for us back then. Let's get this waxwood though, and now we can upgrade our gear. Yeah, I seem to always find waxwood around the shrine, so that's where you need to find them at. With that taken care of, uh, let us see. I guess this right here. And unfortunately, it looks like we can't really fast travel. Usually, there's a way to like get back down the mountain quicker or quickly, but I guess not. I guess I kind of messed that up, didn't I? Well, actually, hold on. We'll just fast travel here. It shouldn't keep me to the top, it should take me down below. Alrighty. I want to check this out as well. Kind of piqued my interest. Oh, uh, there's someone in there. It was wrong for the Shogun to take your lands and title. You will always be a lord to me. That's right, you tell me that or I'll behead you. <laughs> Alright, but no, yeah, there's nothing in there. Alright, so let's make sure we're going the right way. Just go down below. Don't die. Oh, thank God. With my luck, death was near. Alright, now let's see here. As long as we keep on going straight, I think we'll be fine. Oh, there's a bear attacking people. The bear doing a good deed down below. It's actually... Oh, God damn. Quit using the explosive arrows. There we go. Damn it, bear. Don't you dare attack me. No, no. He's running away. He knows better. All right. We're close, though. Question is, is where are we going? Uh, no, that's not a good idea. Hot spring. And, ah, eh, just some deer. For a minute, I thought it was a hog. I was like, uh oh, he's gonna run us over. But yeah, we'll just take a little break here, I suppose, in the old hot spring. Hit my desk. Oh, reflect on Kenji Sake. Only thing that would make this better is a jar of Kenji Sake. But then he'd never stop talking. And of course, we got a little bit of help.
Alrighty, with that taken care of, we can move on here. Goal, hmm. Maybe come back south and kind of clear these out as well. Probably a good idea. Let's go to this hot spring. Call the horse. It's a little bit away, but not too bad. Oh, there we go. Our horse's name is Kage. I remember now. He was uh, thankful enough to help me re remember. Meant for shadow, so, you know, he can be quiet in the night. Maybe not make as much noise as he's making now. Actually, we need to move this way. Go in the completely wrong direction. Seeing that golden tree, though, makes me think that this is a fox, so... We'll be following the fox around for a bit. Yes, take me to where the goods are. You know, apparently the foxes in this game have been like pet, like what, like, I think like hundreds of thousands of times, if not millions of times now from like other players and whatnot. I know I remember like reading about it. Of course, like, why wouldn't you, you know, once you find the shrine, you turn around, there's the fox just waiting to get pet. Except this time. And we're not going to worry about it. We're one more away from getting another charm slot. Want to come up here. To be honest, it's probably better off of if we just kind of go that way. So we'll just call the horse again. Yeah, every every new place we go to gets further and further away. I think it's like on the river. So I think if we just follow it, we're gonna reach it eventually. Let's say it should be easy. Of course then again we might run into some Mongols just chilling out here in the field. Oh no, never mind, that's a deer. Oh, we might have actually have a camp up here. Yeah. I thought all of them were like kind of unlocked, but I guess not. Oh no, never mind. It's down below the camp. And it's a bamboo striking board. Oh. Always have trouble with these. Yeah, get ready to watch failure. Alrighty, oh my. Yeah, <laughs> too slow. The L1 messed me up bad. Uh, my old reflexes. Almost have it though. Got it, thank God. <laughs> Ooh, that was rough. Alrighty, with that one. We might fast travel here. We get the chance. Alrighty. Nah, to be honest, I think it's probably quicker if we just kind of ride that way as well. Again. We should be able just to like ride like straight to it. Oh. Uh, something's over. Yeah, something's over there. All right, it's me, the samurai. We'll get a little bit of, um, renown from this, so it'll be good. Alright, we've got another poison dart, though. Let's see here. Let's move a little bit this way. How's it going? Yeah, we're still going. As long as we go this way, we should be fine. Oh, another survivor's camp. Which is not bad. I mean, there's a little bit of resources we can pick up. Oh, yeah, no problem. I'm talking about Kenji. Once you hear about sake, you know it's about Kenji. <laughs> like, very few people are out here selling sake to Mongols. I used to visit that. Do you need a new quiver? 
No, I'm pretty good traveler, but thank you. All right, with that taken care of, let me see here. We'll go for that one. And this is doing pretty good. I mean, we've already completed like probably like one fourth of the bottom part of the map. Fusel's old straw hat camp. He had a chance to fight for our cause, but I can't forgive a traitor. Oh wow, he actually had some uh, narration for this place. All right, let's see here. Once we get this one, we're gonna go attack that Mongol camp, get it taken care of. Fortunately, it looks like we need to get up here. Exile's Bluff. Yeah, we'll keep on moving. Alrighty, now where is it? Looks like we need to go up a little bit higher. Oh, it's probably a fox, to be honest. I saw the yellow of the tree. Yeah, just keep on moving here. Don't worry, fox, I'm coming. Give me a minute. Alright. Lead me to your shrine. Or I'll skin you alive. Oh, we're going down. Yeah, where are you taking me, fox? The only problem with the fox is sometimes he takes you a good ways away. Oh, we got that new charm slot. Charm slot unlocked. Let's look at it. We can put another one of the basic ones. We'll just put moderate increase to melee damage for now. And then we have a charming man. So we've unlocked that one. I think that's when you unlock all the charms on your person. Yep. But now with that one taken care of, we're going to go... An attack of that. Now we just need to get down from here. Eh, not gonna be a good thing. Alright, where's the horse? Let me see here. It looks like we just go straight. I know this is a cliff, so I know we're gonna like fall to our death. But you know what? A horse might be able to handle it. My lord. Oh. Might have some stuff to say here. What's going on? So many dead. But there's no blood. What happened? A plague, my lord. Dead bodies were dumped in the well, and these people unknowingly drank from it. A terrible way to die. We should bury the dead. Burning them is the only way to keep the plague from spreading. But I fear that may not be enough. One of the sick is missing. I'll find him. There are footsteps leading away from here. I believe he ran for help. If he's alive, I'll get him to a healer. Otherwise, I'll burn the body. Now I'm surprised it didn't, uh... Give us a mission. But okay, so we need to figure out where this dead body went. Maybe, if I can find it. It's like a mis miscellaneous. Here, let me go back, because there should be tracks, pretty much, so. I'm assuming maybe you went the other way? Yep, here we go. Alright, we're on to him now. We're gonna find his body, dead or alive, and set him on fire. <laughs> Simple as that. Maybe. Man, for being, you know, having a play, he sure did make it. I think this is him right here. He looks a little rough. There he is. I 
should let the monk know. Alrighty. Now we have to run all the way back up. We're not going to walk all the way, though. I say, get us going. It feels so much longer when you actually walk down the, the hill than when you just ride. I saw the smoke over the hills. Thank you, my lord. Will the plague be contained? Once I've finished here, I'll seal the well so no one can drink from it. Thank you, my lord. Alrighty. Yeah, I'm, I'm weird we didn't get a tail for that or like a little side mission from it, but I'm not going to worry about it. Let's keep on moving. Get a little bit of bamboo. Let me probably get down. Because there they are. Oh, he's got armor. Or he's got a helmet. I wonder what they're attacking. Oh, wrong button. Is there like a bear or something in there? Like they're all running to attack something. Stagger enemies with a heavy attack, which is just the triangle. Uh, I think this is like Bandits and Mongols attacking each other. Which is actually pretty interesting. This is the first time I've ever saw this. We're just going to let them kind of fight it out. Let's just run in there now. We want to stagger them with the heavy attacks. There's one. There's a second one. Oh my god. Oh, thank god. For a minute there, I thought we were going to be like way up here. Alright, who's coming down? Guy with the sword. He's dead. Does anybody else want to drop down here by any chance? No, nope, can't even get up there. Alright, hold on, I'm coming. We gotta go all the way around. Yes, I am here. Ooh, I see. Hold on, we need the spear. Never mind, we don't need the spear. He's dead. Actually, we might not be able to get our bonus because the... The bandits attacked. He doesn't have a helmet. Should be easy. Okay, here comes another spearman. And we didn't even, we weren't even able to stagger him because he was so aggressive. Alrighty. I think that's everything. It should be cleared out, right? Nope, someone's still alive. Where are the remaining Mongols? They're down here fighting. And apparently a bandit killed him. You gonna come up here? Yeah, definitely a bandit. We'll go back to our half bow. Alright, now we should be cleared. Make sure there's no relics here. Everything seems fine. Oh. A little bit of leather. Alright. With that taken care of, we can do, or we can find these two little locations here. And we're going the wrong way, so it's over here. Might actually have some trouble. A little worried about this one. It's relatively close to... I think we can go around, though, and find it. Yeah, shouldn't be a big deal. Might be easier to climb up here, though. Yeah, seems to be the correct call. Alrighty. 
Okay, Winding Mountain. There's a whole shrine up here. <laughs> I didn't even notice it, not gonna lie. Like, if you're at the Fallen Outpost, like, I guess you just need to look up, maybe. Oh, I'm blind as a bat. All right, now I already see the way where we need to go. Maybe. <laughs> nope, never mind. Alrighty. Keep on moving. Okay, so we got some bamboo, you wood, and some supplies. Oh, more bamboo. Never mind, this might be a dead end. Yeah, I guess this was just a place where... Oh, no, never mind. Found it. For a minute there, I was like, oh, maybe... Oh. Now look at this. Some arrows. Not gonna lie, I didn't even know there's like little hidden areas in the um, cave systems. First one, first time seeing one. Okay, and it wants us to go this way. Maybe down? I don't know, we'll go down just for the stuff though. Another little cave system we gotta take. It's so weird going through the caves, it's like the um the camera angle and all that. Alright, now we need to go over here. And damn, look at that tree. Oh, what a beauty. Kind of surprised it's still alive. Like, you would think it would die of a drought or something. Not enough, like, water. This is a little dangerous, to be honest. But that looks like the way we need to go. A little worried about this one, not gonna lie. And we made it. Alright, looks like it's we're almost there. Alrighty. And we made it up to the shrine. Ooh, hold up. Got a little bit of supplies. Alright, there should probably be some like you wood around here. And just kind of look around. Don't notice it. We'll probably get one when we honor the shrine. Charm of Izanagi? Charm of the Kami of Creation. What is that? Landing a he headshot has a 40% chance to return an arrow. Oh, that's some of that black magic right there. Alright, we got another waxwood. And we can leave right here, right? Yeah. This is a little bit quicker to get down. Alright, with that taken care of... We just have one more to do, like right behind us here. <gasps> yeah, better off just taking the <laughs> the little uh, rock little path there. My luck will be dead instantly. Just splat. All right, what is that? Oh, another fox. Lead me to your leader. This always reminds you of that one mission where you get revenge for the foxes because they're all getting killed by the Mongols. And that one fox was like, it's time for revenge. And then you gotta go kill all the Mongols, pretty much. I mean, it wasn't really the Mongols' fault. They were, like, skinning them for their pelts and whatnot. But still, a bit barbaric. Especially with the Japanese people, you, like, see that the foxes are...
Ooh, charm of Inari's might. Oh, so now we get charms. Let's pet him. Show him that we respect him. Yes, good fox. Tell your brethren to give me supplies. Alright, so with that taken care of... I think we need to do this um, bamboo strike, so... Gonna have a little bit of issues here, not gonna lie. I <laughs> always have problems. I'm like an old man on these damn things. Oh my god, I hit R1. <laughs> That's what I mean. I don't even know if R1's one that you can use, not gonna lie. Oh god. Man, this is actually hard because you need to like count out your... Yeah, this one's gonna be nasty right now. Ugh. Had it though. Got it. Perfect. Alrighty. One step closer. I love the rain in this game though. This is that atmosphere. Alright, let's see here. With that taken care of, I'm guessing we can go for this. We'll fast travel there. Well, might, actually might not be a good idea. Because we're up on like a little cliff here. Oh, well, I guess we'll make it work. Should be relatively easy to get back down. In fact, we might be able just to drop down. Can we just drop down? <laughs> yes, we can. Perfect. Let us call the horse. You behind me? Yeah, I know you have magical powers. Through this. All right, let's see here. You're starting to go the right way. Uh, you know what? He will tell us where another like fighting place would be, another outpost or where something fancy's at. So we'll do a uh, standoff. Try to sneak up on him. Are you cowards? Yes, they are, Jin. They are cowards. Oh, I hate spearmen. There we go. First one's always the hardest. From there, it always gets easier. Alright, one guy remaining, right? He doesn't even have a helmet. Ooh, he was smart. Oh my god, I can't hit him to save my life. Nope, we're not gonna hit him. He ran away. My lord. I was feeling very generous. Thank you for making their calm suffer. What did he give us? Some supplies, maybe? I have no idea. Well, anyways, we got that taken care of. Call the horse again. Your assistance is needed. Oh, and we got another fox shrine. And that's what this this stream is going to be all about. is just us helping the fox find the charms. Probably should have done some of them while we were playing the game, but too busy doing all the missions and all that. Don't have enough time. Man, you're way up here in the mountain, huh? Maybe this would be a little bit quicker using this one. Nope, never mind. No point. Now this one though I have to say is probably the one that's way out of there, like way out of place. Like you would not find it on your own without the help of the fox. Alrighty. Where did you go? Did you run off? I guess he did. Alright, but with that, that's good. Let us 
fast travel here to Komatsu Forge. And hopefully we can uh, clear up this uh, bottom area today. We're already rolling almost nearly an hour. Time flies when you play this game. Well, don't be bathing. Oh, actually, hold on. We want to make sure we put back on the traveler's attire. Make sure we don't miss anything. Alright, we're going the right way. We just only need to leave the city. Try not to die while we're doing that. Let's actually change to the kunai. Oh, no button. But call the horse. Alright, I feel like if we go this way, it'd be the quickest way to get out of here. In fact, we actually didn't even go over here. When we came to, like, clear out this area for the main mission. <laughs> well, here's another fox. Man, there's a lot of these foxes. Like, Jesus. Everywhere you go, there's a fox. Yeah. Like, no wonder the Mongols were skinning them. Every turn, time you turn, there's a fox just looking at you with his big old eyes. He's like, feed me. And you're like, hmm, I could eat him. <laughs> Alright, why did you take me in a big old circle? Okay, hold on, let's not try to... Worst case scenario is we actually go the wrong way here. Man, they get more and more hidden. Alright, we just need one more and then we'll have the Inari Shrine. We'll just use this to get out of here. And nearly die. Alright, so... Now, I wonder why these are whited out, but I think that doesn't mean anything. That's just places of an importance. Let's go here to this box, because we haven't done this one either. Yep, take me to where you need to go. Please be nice. Oh, I see it already. <laughs> right there. He's probably going to take me around the whole mountain. This is what I prefer though. These like quick and easy ones. Can't go wrong. Alright, we have that. So now what happens with that charm? Offensive charm. Okay, so if we look at it, increase health and melee damage by a minor amount. Okay, so that one's actually not terrible. I think it's smaller than that damage. Yeah, just minor, not a moderate. So we're not even going to worry about that one. And we need to clear that one out. Let's go to this hot spring. And this one's actually relatively close. It looks like, oh, it's another shrine. Ah, the shrines are the worst, to be honest. Like, so much difficulty, and it, like, gets you turned around, and you're just like, where am I going? <laughs> yep, Golden Summit Shrine. Given that name due to the trees. And this is actually a little bit of repetition, I feel. Like, similar, you know... Bridge is given out. Do the Mongols? They burn the bridge. We gotta go all around and about to find a way up. <clears throat> Problem is, is, we don't really know how to get up, but found the entrance. Jin's getting tired. Can we make that jump? I don't think we can. 
Oh, well, we don't have to. Good thing I looked down. <laughs> I was about to try to make that jump. Not gonna lie. And we would have failed it to our death. No doubt about it. Alrighty, he wants us to go that way. This kind of looks like a Haku place right there where you can sit down and get a new headband that does not look good at all. Ooh, I, I like that where you can just like go into like a little like inside the mountain. You don't have to like kneel down or crawl. You can just kind of run through. Okay, we would die if we went that way. Let's get this you wood. Flowers. Alrighty, what do we got up here? Oh, someone actually kind of like found a way to get up to the shrine. I guess the bridge was broken for a while. There's just some random citizen just out here, <laughs> like climbing the side of the mountain, putting in uh, bamboo things and whatnot to use to get around. Tell me, what are you giving me? Charm of Amaterasu? Charm of the Kami of the Sun. Killing enemies restores a moderate amount of health. Now that one is pretty good. But I don't really want to get rid of these. Especially that one. Slowly recover health while out of combat. I guess we could like you know, I could take it off when we're in combat and put it back on, but that's too difficult. Like, that's too much work. Alright, but with that taken care of, I feel like we should go for this one. This is out there by its lonesome. Alrighty. Make sure we go the right way. With my luck, Let's I'd go. be going in the completely wrong direction. Kashin. Flowers. Yep, that's our death right there. We'd actually be fine. Our horse would uh, have some issues, though. Oh, you know what? We might have to do it regardless. Let's see here. It's like right down here. Horse, don't you dare stop. Oh, never mind. I thought it was going to be a lot worse. You got a lucky horse. Of course, it's another fox, though. Alrighty. Let's keep on following him. I wonder if we're going to pet this one or not. I wonder, can you kill a fox? We might try that. You know, I might get my bow out, shoot him, and see what happens. Might, you know... Something bad might happen, you never know. Like, you know, like in The Witcher, if you kill, like, cows or whatnot, you know, this giant monster comes to kill you. I wonder if the giant fox comes to kill you if we, um, kill the fox. We'll be barbaric, you know, we'll just kind of chop him up, eat him for dinner. We might try it here, let's see. See if I can put him down with an arrow. Okay, hold on, let me pet him first. Never mind, doesn't want me to pet him. And then we'll shoot him with the bow. We'll be heartless. Let's see what happens. Uh, nope, he takes it like a champ. <laughs> He's invulnerable. He's a god fox. Alright, that one. I guess we're just gonna go here to the farmstead. Should be simple. 
Call the whores. And luckily we spawned like on the outside, so relatively easy to get to the place because it's like right in front of us here. Another, no, we don't want to do a standoff. We're like right here. Let's see, we want to kill the guys in the shelter. Uh, get off the horse. I'm trying to get greedy and get that bamboo. Alright. I'm surprised no one was in this tower. Is there like anybody in here? Kill an enemy while concealed in a smoke bomb. We can definitely do that. Let me see here. Smoke bomb. We run in. I'm here. Kill him. Might be out. Yeah, didn't work out for us here. I was better off going after one of these weaker enemies, to be honest. My bad. And we killed them all. We're so close, though, of getting, like, all of our things. I think once we finish that last one, it's going to be, like, Ghost of Tsushima. And then we'll get another achievement. And we got a fight for the isle. Did we complete it? Oh, look at that. We liberated it. One down, three more to go. Pick up some more supplies here. Not really worried. Like, really, the only thing we needed was, like, the wax wood. And we're getting that from finding the shrines. And there's no artifacts here, so let's get out of here. Call the horse again. He's behind us. All right, let's keep on moving. And I think where we need to go is like in the middle of this lake. Fortunately, I don't think there's a quick way to get there. Or if there is, it's like on the opposite side of the lake. So we're just going to swim over. Hopefully we don't get attacked. Maybe a giant uh, carp or a koi. Big old koi, you know. 100 pounder just comes and gnaws on our uh, leg while we're swimming. That'd be pretty cool. I wonder how how big you can get a koi. I know they can get big depending on the, like, you know, their location. Just get swallowed up by a piece of koi or koi fish. I'd be like, yeah, human tastes pretty fancy. You know, during this war, we've been eating on a lot of dead bodies. All right, but here we go. Reflect on refuge. All right, what do you got for me? Calm waters, calm mind. A golden, there's not even a golden temple here. A world's reflection. Right, let's go with uh, calm waters, calm mind. Growth that shelters all it sees. Submerged deep in nature's shade. That kind of goes with the water theme. Sturdy do we stand. Now, ever unbending. Calm waters, calm mind. Submerged deep in nature's shade. Ever unbending. There we go. We got another headband. We're not going to put it on. They never look good. Ever. And then with that taken care of. And we still got quite a bit of uh, unknown items here. I think what we're going to do though. Is we're going to clear out this bottom area. And then we're going to call it a day. I'm going to look at the stream and stuff. Once we do that. And make sure everything's okay. Or see if I can fix it. In the next one probably. But yeah. So let's keep on going there. Because we've already liberated all of the outposts here. So now it's just going to be us following foxes. And probably cutting bamboo. I would assume. But we shall find out. Man, I do love the golden forest, though. Like, so peaceful. 
Like, we don't have anything like this here in America. <laughs> or at least not where I'm from. So oh, don't die. Alright, honor that shrine. Alright, Fox. I know you weren't there that quickly. You teleporting on me? Charm of silence. Alright, let's pet him. No need to shoot him. We already know we can't hurt him. Alright, he's happy. Uh, have we a light? Yeah, I think we have. I'm not for sure, but we can always... I think we have the option of looking for, like, uh... We are the lighthouses, right? No, we don't. Okay. Well, I mean, maybe the lighthouses would be, like, dark or something like that. If we need to clear them out. So I'm not too worried. Anyways, let's keep on going here. We need to get that one. Fastest way would probably be... Yeah, we'll go to the survivor's camp. Alrighty. And we'll just follow the path. It should lead us right to it. Oh, we can actually see if it's lit or not from here. Alrighty. Still don't see if... Okay, it is flamed. We're good. Just gotta make sure. Looks like we'll be rolling with another fox, though. And we might actually get attacked by some mongols here. Depending on where he takes us. Because I think there's like two or three mongols right over here chilling. And we might put him down. And we'll do a standoff, yeah. Come here, guys. Let me kill about two or three of you. You got wood in here. That's no. Oh, I know better. I was say, I messed up last time. Pretty simple, and then we're just gonna kill that guy before he falls down or does anything bad. You'll be free soon. Thank goodness. You're safe now. Please, this is for you. I still don't know what she gives us, though. It doesn't, like, tell me or anything. Like, the only thing I know is it give me, like, some renown or whatnot. Alright, well, we'll keep on moving. I think we're gonna have the most trouble trying to find the banners. Because there's, like, 80 banners in all. I think I have, like, 40 or something like that. So I know we're gonna be there a while. Alright, we just need one more. I hate how you have to wait, like, a second. Oh, I think that's a banner, right? Talking about banners, I think there's one right there. We'll go see, just to make sure. Last thing I would want is us, like, having to... Come all the way back for it. Actually, I think this is another, uh, location that we need to look at. A lot of people got killed over here. And a pillar of honor. Alright, what will we be rolling with next? Yasha's Embers. Beware the warrior's fiery vengeance. Oh. Kind of looks like eyes in the darkness. But yeah, we're rolling with that. And man, that's vibrant. Alright, let's see. Where are we going now? Two mysteries here. We'll go to this fox den. Alright, let's see here. Let's get one of them. We're going the wrong direction. Go a little far. Get back on the horse. Oh, looks like the yellow bird's gonna lead us. It must be a hot springs or something then. It is another pillar of honor. 
This one looks green. Green's my favorite color. Spring bamboo, even the oldest samurai fights with the vigor of youth. Yeah, let's roll with it. And then from there, we're just gonna move a little bit more this way. And it's a place where we can do another, what, haku, I think. Yep, might as well do that as well after I get this flower. I guess we'd be rolling in the night too. Reflect on fear. Okay. Secrets buried deep. Whispers drawing near. Or disappearing light. Alright, so if this is about fear, let's do whispers drawing near. Kind of like your mind playing tricks on you because you're afraid and whatnot. Shifting shadows back and forth. Darkness grows and reaches out. Threads concealed waiting all. Let's do, um... Shifting shadows back and forth. I don't know. Let's just roll with it. Cloaked in death's armor? Hidden from all sight. I kind of like that one. Ooh, that moon's bright. Guided by night's glow. You know what? The moon's so bright, we're going to do that one. Whispers drawing near. Shifting shadows back and forth. Guided by night's glow. Already had been a fear. We got rid of those two pretty easily. So now we're going to be rolling a little bit north. Uh, let me see here. It's probably easier. Uh, we can't fast travel. I right, can now. It ain't one thing, it's another. Alright, with that. Call the horse. Let's keep on moving. Why do I hear drums going off? Oh, there's something here. Kill him. I missed him. Sorry, we're gonna kill him before he gets here. Okay, there's um, crickets or something here. Let us. Yeah, let us need or uh, bow to this. Alrighty, that's been taken care of. Oh, there's like a little camp here. You're dead. Sorry to say. And there's the uh, relic. <laughs> shoot him in the back, because it's actually better off putting him down. If we shoot him in the head, we won't kill him. Oh, actually, that body, I think. Oh, for a minute there, I thought the body was on fire. Alright, I know there's a guy still alive somewhere. There's two of them. Alright, last one. He's looking the other way. Should be easy. Alrighty. And we already know where the relics is. It's up here. Alrighty, what do we got? Juniper. Mongol shamans often imbibe a variety of substances during their ritualistic ceremonies. Juniper, which is mildly hallucinogenic, is one such substance. The shaman ignites the juniper, waves it in front of their faces, and inhales the smoke, which is believed to be pleasing to the spirits as well. Pretty simple. Ooh, stay away from that fire. It <laughs> might kill you. I'll say that wind's got that flame going all over the place. Oh, there's some supplies, though. Can't get to it. Maybe from over here? Nope, never mind. The supplies don't exist. We don't know what I'm talking about. Alright. We'll just follow this little pathway. Never mind. The wind is telling us to go elsewhere. 
All right, looks like we... Oh, another survivor count. All right, well, nothing too crazy. All righty. Let's see here. Man, it's starting to get a little pain because everything's like so far away now. Okay, well, best case scenario is we start kind of working this way, so we'll go for that one. Custom, okay. We just need to keep on going this way. I don't think we need to go up the mountain. Of course, then again, it might be easier. Now we'll find out when we get up here. Is there anything of value up here? Oh, there's actually a little, uh, there's a road up here. Should make it actually easier for us to get to where we need to go. Yeah, right here. Wow. Didn't even notice that, not gonna lie. I think this was a part of the mission where we need to clear this out of Mongols. And it was like the first time we used our, um, hook or whatnot. Um, let me look here. Okay. We just need to keep on going straight. It's another fox, apparently. Alright. Take me to where we need to go. Oh, here comes the golden bird. He's like, oh, you got a fox? Well, how about you go this way instead? Some very interesting things over here. All right, where are you taking me? Right over here. Charm of silence, huh? Actually, we should probably see what that does. Reduce enemy detection speed by 15% and increases resolve gain by a minor amount. Honor additional Inari shrines to permanently increase this charm's effectiveness. Also, it gets stronger and stronger the more shrines you visit. Now that's interesting. I'll go for that one. That's probably the one the golden bird was trying to draw us to. And we'll keep on moving now. Oh, it's another haiku place. Okay. I don't think it really matters, to be honest. I've been doing so many of these now. Alrighty, reflect on peace. Following the breeze, a hidden respite. Watching overall. Well, if this is peace, let's go with um, following the breeze. Just having a chill time, you know, rolling. Yeah, gently cleansing, stand refreshed. Sure. Hastening forward. Prepare to chance. Let's go. Let's go with hastening forward. Following the breeze. Gently cleansing. Stand refreshed. Hastening forward. Alrighty. Headband of peace. And we'll just keep on going here, apparently. All right, so there's a body of water down below, but it looks like there's a shrine on the other side, so I do not want to go down below. So we gotta somehow figure out how we can get over there without dropping down there. And you know what, it might actually be easier than I thought. Especially with a horse that can, like, jump over anything. Alright, this might lead to where we need to go. Yeah. 
I know there's a path down there. That's gonna kill us. Yep. <laughs> ah, there I go again. But luckily we found the shrine, so now we can kind of fast travel to it. And it should put us on the right path here. Yeah, down below. Now this is pretty nice though because the bamboo's pretty much been taken over by like the moss and all that. Man, I'm glad it kind of like forced me to go that way. If not, I would have definitely went the wrong way there. We don't need the bamboo. I mean, we got plenty. I say we're solely after the uh the top, but I will take some supplies. Just right there. Ready for the picking. Guess if we want a flower, we can go up. I'll say, hopefully it starts leading us up, though. I know that's where we need to go. There. Yep, now it's going to start leading us up. Alrighty. Man, our guy can make some leaps, let me tell you. Oh, here we go. This one is actually relatively easy to get to. Beautiful place though, especially with those waterfalls. I wouldn't mind seeing that in real life, you know? Kind of swim down there in the lake. Pluted a little bit with my own being. All the people be all pissed off, like, why is that guy desecrating our sacred lake? Charm of the Kami of Water, what does that do? Parries, perfect parries, and perfect dodges are easier to perform. Ooh. Now that's one you would want. And I'm assuming it just makes the window longer. Yeah, you can't go wrong with that one. And we got those two, those three, a couple four there. There's a whole island <laughs> that we need to explore. Alrighty, well with those. I suppose the fastest way is probably to fast travel. So we'll go to the bamboo strike. Probably the easiest way. It wants us to go that way though, unfortunately. That is away from where we're gonna be going. But there might be a little pathway through. Let's actually check over here. Looks like this might lead out. Eh, maybe not. Looks like no matter what, we're gonna go all the way around. Yeah, yes. No problem, citizen. Yeah, we're kind of stuck here. Oh, well, you know what? Never mind. We got a little pathway here. Uh, taking us kind of the wrong way, but we'll go for those instead. And then we'll just work our way back. Well, I'll say probably an easier. Here comes the thunder. Gonna strike me down. Okay, we're getting close now. Oh, but looks like there might be some Mongols. Oh, no, bandits. Missed completely. Ah, he got me. God damn it. I hate y'all. Damn bandits. I do nothing wrong to y'all. This is what y'all do to me. You're dead. One good thing is, is like the resource box is like really good. It's like probably one of the best ones, like the most resources you can get in game. So we'll roll with that. How far are we? Pretty close. And the bird's gonna lead us, huh? 
I mean, it's probably gonna be a hot spring. I have a weird feeling. Oh, we're still going the right way. Uh, might be a banner. I'll say the controller vibrated on me a little bit. White dye merchant. Uh, <sighs> cut some bamboo. All right, get ready to watch failure. We're definitely gonna have some trouble here. All righty. <laughs> yep, we're having problems already. Okay, hold on. Let me look here. Okay. No, I went wrong. It actually kind of looked like it went right. It's all these X's and triangles. There we go. I got serious there for a minute. Let's talk to this die guy too. Oh, controller's gonna die. It's not good. He's got a bunch of flowers, so we'll take it. I thought all the samurai were dead. Is that any way to greet a visitor? Forgive my manners, my lord. I spend all my time alone. My only company is dyes and brushes, lacquer and cloth. I've perfected a shade of white like sparkling virgin snow in frozen jogaku. Bring me the necessary ingredients and I will adorn you in white like death itself. Death is in white, huh? Okay, so what do you got? You got a oh, nine tail fox, so that's a little clap back to uh Naruto. Well <laughs> take that, sure. We got so many flowers anyways. Their eyes to see you. Oh you have a white one for the traveler's attire. Oh yes, please. You like frost on the cloud -lit day. Uh, I mean I, I don't really want that to be honest. Thank you. Okay, hold up though. Hold up. Uh, armor options. Yeah, we're rolling with that. We've been rolling with blue for like so long. Okay, but there's definitely a relic nearby. It might be up here. My family has used But I doubt it. Because it feels like it's far away. But it wouldn't be the first time I've been tricked. My dyes are white as No, it's not up here. I'm trying to see if we can find something. Let's go back down, though. It was worth a shot. Didn't work out. Let me look here. Isn't there another... I guess not. We did both of them, yeah. So... It's probably a banner. I would assume. Because it's, like, hard to find. It's usually what they are. A pain in the butt to find, really. They're like, hidden out there in the middle of the woods. And they're like... Oh, we need you to find about 80 of them. Can you do it? And you're like, what? <laughs> 80? If weirdly enough, it feels like stronger like around here. Okay, I feel nothing there. When I go over here, I feel nothing as well. But when I come over here, I feel something. So it's definitely over here somewhere. This is like very faint. Oh, it's right there. Yeah, like look at that. Look how well hidden that was. All right, we have 45 of them, which is good. Now let's fast back, fast travel back to Komoda again. I'm just glad we're rolling in white though, or like a different, you know, color than our normal travels attire yeah like that's what's got me really excited you know all right let's see here going the wrong way turn this bad boy around and let's try to figure out a way out of this city oh, i'm gonna get lost here Alrighty, now which pathway? I guess it really doesn't matter. 
we'll take this one and we're gonna go for seeing how it's like a split road it's probably gonna be another fox usually the foxes are like on the trails and the pathways So I guess we're going to start working on our last, or one of our last, um, charms here. Yeah, I'm following you. Man, he feels a little bit slower, though. I was like, Jim might have gained a little bit of weight or something. Putting that die on. But now it's just because he's going, like, up a mountain. Alrighty, let's see what charm we're working on here. This one is the oh increased charm power. So we got we've unlocked all the charms. I'm assuming now we're just kind of working on the making them even stronger. Okay, so now we want that one, which is leading us back towards the town. We're not gonna fast travel because I have so much trouble finding a way out. Get on a horse, though. Oh, you know what, horse? For us. <laughs> I'll make that jump. Uh, never mind, he's trying to be safe. He knows better. He's like, oh, I ain't gonna die for you. That was a nice jump, though. Are these bad guys? Yes, they are. I'm glad I checked. We would have literally, like, ran into him and be like, hey, buddies. How are y'all doing? There's probably a, um. Singing cricket somewhere. Oh my god, I can't hit this guy to save my life. Just catch yourself on fire. Don't even give him a... Ooh. You know, I'm gonna go kill your buddy first. So I don't have to worry about this later. Alright, hold on. Let's go for these guys as well. They kind of remind me of, like, bandits. But seeing this guy... There we go. Alrighty, singing crickets right there. Now we on that. We're actually close to that one as well. It's probably all we needed, really. Well, that's the problem with the uh, singing crickets, though, is they don't have an actual like location on the map. So we're going to have to use our wind to figure them out when we get everything done and taken care of unfortunately I guess we'll do a little haiku while we're here make it quick I don't like I said I don't think it really matters if we're reflecting on death what are we rolling with here resilient and strong yep that's what death is. Resilient and strong. You never get away from it. I always gonna find you. A lone pebble alters fate. Doubtful warriors fall. Birth anew. And last but not least, rising from the depths. Resilient and strong. Warriors fall. Birthed anew. Rising from the depths. All right, there we go. Another headband. And we have two out here on the coast, which are going to be a pain. Because they're, like, far away. And not as bad as it could have been. Fortunately, it looks like we need to go that way. It's all right, we'll make it. So I just climb up here. We're gonna call the horse once we get to some good ground here. Alrighty. And I know there's some lighthouses we missed as well, so it might be one of these. Uh, never mind, I'm a lot closer to the coastline than I thought. Oh. <laughs> Big old bushes, apparently. We can't even go through them. Even with the horse, they're like a magical wall. They're like, no, sir. Alright, well, we'll just, uh, piss off all the deer. Yeah, but no, in real life, we smack into these trees, we'd have ourselves a little issue. <laughs> Guy would be, like, smacked in the face. 
Actually, the horse would probably be like, screw you. Throw us off. Be like, you're on your own, buddy. All right. It actually wants us to go backwards. Do a critical strike. And he's done. We'll break him. Oh, wow, you actually handled that pretty well. We gotta be careful with the shield, man. Or not the shield, but the uh, spear. Oh, never mind. It doesn't even matter. That was smooth. Not gonna lie. Let's collect that. Got a little bit of steel. It wanted us to come back over here. See what it's leading us to. Okay, it's to the side. We'll turn when we get up here. So I'm feeling like it's like way up here in the mountain. We're lucky enough though that there's a little rock pathway up there. Keep on moving. I must say find a way. If there's no path, make a path. Alrighty, and then we'll get up here. I feel like we went a very far ways away to make this work. But this is the way we need to go. Let's fast travel there. I feel like we're kind of stuck there on the rocks, so make it a little bit easier. Then from here, it should be just down here. Oh, this is not good. This is a, a long fall. <laughs> yeah, we took it like a champ, though. I gotta be real careful, because I will kill myself. Alright, another fox. Oh, I'm getting greedy. I die when I get greedy. Alrighty. What do you got for me, Fox? Yeah, I'll follow you. Come on now. Lead me. We going all the way down the mountain? You gonna do me dirty like that? Let's see where he goes. You gonna turn or what are you doing? Okay. Now nah, it looks like we don't even have to worry about that. The Mongols are still out there. Even though we beat the game, we killed the Khan. They're still rolling. Alrighty, working on that. Okay, hold on. There's an island, isn't there? Where is this island? Yeah, it's right there. So it's gotta be that one. Looks like the game's being nice enough, though, to give us a little quick way down. I have to do probably a little bit of swimming. Let's make sure we're going the right way. We'll uh, mark it on the map. I think it's that one right there, but I'm not 100% for sure. There's actually something down in there. Might be like a hidden boat or something. Yeah, I think this is where we need to go. Stone Dragon Shrine. Oh, it looks like someone had a little camp there. Yeah, they probably uh, paid some bandits or something like that. We had a mission similar where people were paying bandits to like take their families off the island and they were just killing them and taking the money and their valuables because, you know, since they're leaving the island, they'd bring all their priceless uh, family. You know, whatever it is, you know, jewelry or whatever you found, you know, important. Okay, thank God we didn't die. I was worried there for a minute. Oh, hold on before I do any jumping here. That would have been really bad if I just uh, went with what I was uh, thinking about doing there. Yeah, I probably die more by shrines than anything else in this game. <laughs> like, I'm always being risky. 
Okay, where are we going? Like this right here, this is causing problems. Oh, we squeezed through. Like that right there would have got me killed. All right, let's look for some yew wood. Yeah, here we go. Or wax wood. Wax wood is like the rarest wood in the game. So when you're by the shrines, you want to like look around because there's usually one around. And then the charm of Susano. Charm of the Kami of Storm. Staggering enemies have a 30% chance, 30 chance to be knocked down. And not bad. Not going to use it. <laughs> All right. So now with those, we only have a few more to go here on the first bottom island. And then we have to go for the top ones up above. But we'll do that in the next one. But right now, let's get done with these. One, two, three, four, five question marks remaining I'm excited I say I'm ready to go to bed all right let's see here call the horse and rest soon. oh god damn even that was weird I just talked about going to sleep and then Jen's like we'll get some rest soon coincidence I think not the game's listening to me oh that was weird Like, man, that, that's a pretty big coincidence right there. Let's go, I don't know, but the, the governments, they're listening in on me. Climb up the mountain, though. I think that'll make it quick. Yeah, that was right. All right, we'll just go here. Castle Lookout, lookout Hot Spring. Don't die. Alright, get ready to see some man ass here, pretty much. Alright, what are we going to be reflecting on today? My poison, my legacy. Let's do my legacy. How will people remember the Sakai name? As heroes of Tsushima, or fugitives forgotten in the shadows. Eh, probably forgotten in the shadows, but I mean, even great men be get forgotten. This is part of time. The viciousness of time is every great thing ends up being forgotten. You know, just think about, like, back in the day, like, Native American tribes, you know. There's probably hundreds of leaders, you know. They had successful battles, and then they also had battles where they've fallen. And, you know, don't remember them. That's right. They might be in certain books, but have you read that book, you know? So, it's sad, but it is, you know, it is what it is. Alright, what do we got here? Another fox. And there is too many of y'all in this game. I'm just gonna say that right now. Way too many foxes here. Like, I thought when we got that, like, last charm, I was like, alright, we're done with foxes. Not even close. And I heard that in the next um, Assassin's Creed game. They're gonna have cats. <laughs> so, I guess when that comes out, you're gonna be running around pe picking up big old fat cats. They're not even cats, they're like, I don't know, they're like three cats combined into one. They're like giant. Like a whole goddamn mountain lion almost in size, or bobcat. And I'm like, goddamn, that's the biggest cats I've ever seen. Call the horse. But yeah, we'll probably play that game when it comes out, not gonna lie. I think it comes out... I know it comes out later in the year. Alright, what do we got here? What's going on? 
Uh, nothing to be really worried about. We'll just leave them be. I mean, the like reputation we get from it is like so small. It's not even worth it. Let's go to our longbow. Don't want to waste my uh, fire arrows if I don't have to. Uh, of course, someone wants to fight. Let's see here, we're close though. Looks like it's just right up here in this mountain. Uh, but of course, can't get through that. Yeah, we're just gonna go up the mountain. Catch me if you can, you bastards. Must say good luck. Oh, they are gonna shoot arrows at me. Hopefully they don't hit me. Oh, another hot springs. Firefly Hill. Hot springs. I wonder if we're gonna see fireflies here. Whole herd of them. 50 fireflies just come to attack them and pelt them like mosquitoes. Oh, my dead horse, definitely. I love that horse. Sora, you are a brave companion, a good friend. Maybe I'll see you soon. Yeah, I'd be pissed off. Man, our health is like getting so high though, finding all these areas. Might have been easier if we actually did that, you know, back in the day. Alright, but with that one, we just have, what is that, two more to go? Let me make sure, yeah, just two more to go, perfect. Let's keep on rolling. And where do we need to go? We need to go this way. So it wants us to, oh, I already know what it is, it's gonna be a fox. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> I'm glad we didn't die, though. <laughs> oh, I was worried. That was a pretty, you know, long fall there. If that was anybody, their, like, arms or legs would have been broken, depending on what they fell on. Alright, well, I think that's where we need to go, right? Straight? Yep. We can already see the tree from all the way over here. I'll say, don't mind me. Then the other one is somewhere over there. We've got a few more arrows for our bow. We'll go back to the half bow. A couple of uh, stags. Beautiful horns. Those are trophies. No matter which way you look at it, like, look at him. He's such a biggin. Yes, run deer. All right. We're following you, Fox. Come on now. Nope, got stuck. Oh, there's some Mongols too. Hopefully we don't run into them. But it seems like that's exactly where the fox is taking us though, apparently. He's like, you don't mind killing a few Mongols, do you? Well, you know what? We might as well kill him. Actually, you know what? Hold on. Let's go with the hallucination. We'll get the guy with the heavy armor. He's gonna, like, kill most of them. And then let us kill... Oh. Well, that didn't work out. Got him that time, though. We can use ghosts, though, to our advantage. Super loud. Oh, he's running away. God damn it. Yeah, don't worry, I'll save you. You're going to be alright. Oh, I can't believe my luck. Be careful up there. Please. A token of my gratitude. Yeah, it has to be supplies or something. Something not noticeable. Ooh, we got it. The ghost of a legend. Ghost of Tsushima. I think that's as far as we can go. We can't go any further. Yeah, look at that. Leveled up fully. Charm of uneven standing. Sticky bombs knock down all affected targets, leaving them vulnerable for longer. And then we have a pillar of honor. And man, look at them trees. It kind of looks like an arena of some type. 
and it wants us to bow as well. Ooh, and the crab showed up. Honor the Unseen. We got another trophy. The Terrible Force of an Unseen Tempest. We'll roll with it for now. And never mind these, uh, I guess the Mongols tied up people on all the pillars and put them to the down. But now if we look here, I think we've completed the bottom portion of the map. So... With that being the case, we're going to stop here today. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I hope you enjoyed. And in the next one, we'll clear out Toyota Tama and then Kami... Gata. Kami Agata. Something like that. My Japanese are very bad. Anyways, hope you enjoyed. See you all again in the next stream.